Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In sa video na to, discuss natin yung isa sa mga JavaScript fundamental which is na introduce sa ES6 and that is ternary operator. So ano nga ba yung ternary operator? It is a short one-line conditional statement na nire-replace yung ating if-else statement. So mas pinaikli na yung ating if-else statement. And um, if ginagamit mo to sa React, usually uh, in the JSX na syntax na. So palaging ginagamit yung ternary operator. Okay? So, let's see the syntax. So, it will be condition. And then, after the argument na condition, it will evaluate if it's true or false. So, you will put like a question mark. So, after the question mark is the return if the condition is true. So, true for now. And after that, if meron kang else statement, you can return uh, after a colon. So, false. So, ito yung syntax niya. Okay? So, let's try to test this one out. So, let is hot. Okay? Try natin siyang true. Kasi mainit ngayon. Okay? Tapos, i-consider natin yung condition. So, let condition equals is hot. So, yung is hot na, yung magiging um, conditional statement natin dito. So, since true ang is hot, ano kaya magiging return ito? So, i-console that lang natin. Condition. Okay? Then, i-run natin siya. Node index.js Then, ba Makita mo? True yung return niya kasi is hot is true. So, hindi lang naman boolean yung values. Pwede rin numbers, pwede rin strings. No? Depende sa argument mo. Na, at yung mga pwede mong i-return is pwede rin ganun. So, for example, um, meron kang is hot. Okay, pwede ka mag-return ng string. It is very hot. Okay? Then, sa false, sabihin natin, no. It is cold. Okay. So, tignan natin if it falls natin to. Ayan. So, i-run natin ulit. And then, ba, makita mo na yung sagot is, or yung log natin is, no, it is cold. Kasi false yung ating is hot dito. Okay. So, that's one example. Another example for the ternary operator is what if nested if else statement naman yung ay convert natin. So, try muna natin na output or ilag sa console to. So, index.js. So, regular if else statement. So, letter C yung sagot dito. So, that is correct. So, we will convert this into a ternary operator. So, follow me. So, for example, you have declared a variable. So, oh, depende sa'yo if let or const. No? So, const final mark equals. So, let's see. Meron kang grade. No? If grade is greater or equal to 90, Okay. Then, i-return natin yung A. Okay. So, what if meron kang another else if? So, same lang, no? Previously, so we'll have that colon. And then, you will pass that condition. So, grade greater equal to 80. Then, a cycle. So, it's just a cycle. So, question mark, return B. So, you have another else if statement. So, put a colon. And then your condition, which is in grade, is greater than or equal to 70. And then return letter C. So, else. So, else na yung natira. So, what will you do? Lalagay mo na lang yung colon. And then return that. And then hit save. So, let's try if para yung sagot. So, final mark. Then, ilag natin. And bam! Let, para yung lang sila na sagot. So, letter C. So, ganito ang pag-convert ng nested. Uh, if a statement into a ternary operator. Tapos, 